Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with another FGO video reaction. This is another um, AMV, I think. Uh, it's kind of similar to uh, the video I reacted to before this, which is Arc One Solomon. Um, I, from the thumbnail the, uh, the, I could gather that it's also kind of like a sketched thing and I'm also quite looking forward to reacting to this. And uh, this also contains a song, copyrighted song. So I'll have, probably have to mute the uh, you know audio but i'll be uh, like you know putting a timer and the link in the description box of the original video so that you can play it alongside my reaction if you want to so yeah okay so let's react to this this is called fgo goodbye dr roman from the title itself i can probably understand what's going to happen in this so yeah let's get ready i guess because this is this this whole like you know this section of uh saying goodbye to dr roman and like you know the end of the singularities you know the solomon singularity the end what happens as like you know dr roman's fate that is a very um sad topic sad incident and yeah it's one of the most emotional parts of fc fgo so um, yeah this will be a bit emotional i guess but <clears throat> okay let's get started anyway so uh let's react to this this is FGO doc, uh, Goodbye Dr. Roman and let's start. <clears throat> Blue and count. Yeah, it is hand drawn. <laughs> Chopping. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, oh boy. <laughs> the annoying alarm <laughs> sounded like you. Oh boy. God. Oh my god. Um <laughs> god. Damn, this is like uh... Whoa, what are they? Why did they show? Um... Oh, my God. The song itself is so good. <laughs> oh, my God, look at this pic. Wow. <laughs> if you feel like coming home, please come back. If you ever feel like it. Oh 
Wow, that was really good. I'm sorry I was unable to react too much because like like what can I even say? Like we know what happens and Oh boy, that's it. Okay, so Damn this whole this whole like you know the, as I said like uh the whole thing of the Solomon, you know uh the fate of Dr. Roman that in itself is uh it's a what can I say? Like we've like you know like when we started the game, we've been uh, continuously seeing him. Like Doctor Roman and uh, Da Vinci, both of them, you know, like both of them, they are like one of the what can I say? The central part of the game, you know. Even though like you know that there are the different servants and all, they are there. Like, but like Da Vinci and Roman are like the, you know, what can you say? The I don't know, like they, they, they have been from the beginning and they like, you know, like they, they, they're like one of the central parts of the, of FGO. And if one of them, like, you know, like, like goes away and never comes back, kind of sad. Now, one thing I kind of know, and I'm not sure if this is, if I should mention this or not, it is probably considered as a spoiler. People who, uh, I think, you know, uh, are following JP uh, know this most probably and I have also heard about it and I've seen uh, there are a few hints here and there which probably shows that Dr. Roman might come back I'm not sure you know like there's this whole thing of I remember um uh what was it the lost belts you know all the lost belts that we have played uh, the four lost belts in every lost belt there's a certain section where there's like an mysterious individual who kind of goes around like you know helping people and at first like you know in the first singularity i thought it was musashi you know because musashi also came like you know after that and uh, the first singularity uh, not singularity sorry uh the first lost belt um the russian lost belt you know uh and the russian lost belt when that scene was shown and then when musashi, musashi came out i was like oh so that was musashi that mysterious individual but then, after I played the second and the third Lost Belt, I realized that it was not Musashi. Musashi was something, someone who, who was completely different. That person who has been going around helping others is someone completely different. And we kind of saw a little portion dedicated to that person, every Lost Belt, you know. And uh, from the, like, you know, uh, AMV, I think it's an AMV, no, not an AMV, from that opening, um, uh, Maya Sakamoto's opening, uh, the, uh, I can't remember the name, you know, uh, what was the name of the song? I forgot. Uh, it was song, sung by Maya Sakamoto, that I remember. Uh, Cosmos is the, in the Lost Bills opening, uh, Yakudo. Uh, that song Yakudo by Maya Sakamoto in that or uh, like AM, AM, MV of that opening, you know uh, We kind of get a glimpse of what's going to happen like you know the future servants and all and uh, uh, There we get a little glimpse of dr. Roman as far as I can remember and all these kind of like, you know really hints like you know that Dr. Roman might come back, but that does not like you know that would that like even if he comes back that would probably not what do you call it make us feel less sad when we get to the scene of solomon you know like the whole you know, emotionally charged uh scene of dr roman sacrificing himself and yeah that won't go away and like it's kind of like da vinci in a way as well because da vinci also like you know like dies but we get the other Da Vinci, the, you know, the, the other da, da Vinci that we have now. Uh, so the kind of the same, but not the same at the same time. So it's still sad, you know, like these scenes, even though we know that like a few of the characters might come back or might not come back. It's still sad, these, these scenes. So yeah, that was something like Solomon was very, <coughs> what can I say, emotionally packed emotion packed emotionally charged <clears throat> oh boy yeah
Mm. Okay, that was it, guys. That was FG or Doctor Goodbye, Doctor Roman, and uh, the song. Uh, who sung this? Oh, Blue and Count. The uh, okay, okay. Oh, they kind of showed us Blue and Count before the, uh, the start. Okay. <clears throat> so yeah, I, I I think this is this is probably the video where I barely reacted to anything. You know, like I, like these type of things, I usually don't know what to say. Like, what can I even say in these type of like you know, like this is like a scene where we see like you know, Doctor Roman kind of, you know, like you know, like with the, the him and the normal things that he did, kind of hanged around, had fun. You know, like he, we saw him like you know, kind of hugging foe and sleeping, <laughs> and like you know, kind of uh, like Gudako kind of <laughs> poking him. <laughs> and you know like him calling uh, like uh, waking people like you know waking uh, gudao up like all those scenes you can see so and i don't know like I'm, I'm i'm kind of like you know like i usually don't know how to react to these type of things and that's why probably the, the whole, throughout the whole video i barely said anything so <laughs> yeah all right so and that's it it's, it's sad you know and uh, again, the Solomon OVA, the move, uh, which, uh, not OVA, sorry, the movie um, that's going to come out. Damn, that'll be like I, I'm, I'm sure most, most of the people have seen it. I think you know who, the people who live in Japan. Uh, like it came out in theaters as far as I, uh, like you know, it has already been out for quite a long while. So they've already seen it, but you know, like, and obviously we also have played it, but. I think it, the impact will be a lot more when we see it see it ourselves when it comes out uh, you know the blu-ray versions come out digitally and damn the impact will it will be something boy just can't like you know one after the other the whole like situation of events like uh, well, like you know first, first mass sacrificing herself then uh, then comes you know uh, What's that? A uh, foe, uh, not foe, sorry. After that comes Romani. Dr. Romani, like, you know, also kind of sacrificing himself uh, for the, you know, the, the, uh, the, uh, the magic that he does. What was the Ars Nova? I think I can't remember. Uh, something like that. And then the whole, like, you know, uh, foe coming and foe saying, like, you know, explaining her, his identity and bringing Marsh back. That's another emotionally charged portion. And Fujimaru kind of going up and swinging the shield all these scenes yeah like seeing them animated with voice acting wow that will be yeah and with, with the bgm and stuff wow that will be that will be great and i'm really looking forward to the solomon movie so yeah that's it that is it guys thank you guys for watching and i'm i'm like you know i'm kind of doing these things again because i have a little bit of time the only land uh, rerun is going on and it's very chill like you know we've already like i've already played it so i can skip all the stuff and like only farm <laughs> so i have a lot of time and uh so i'm kind of doing these type of things again uh i think i'll also react to another one which is i'm quite curious about is it also kind of looks like something like this like you know hand-drawn um music video or something uh which i'll probably do in a few more days three or four more days after that i'll make a reaction video on that so yeah that's it thank you guys for watching if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed uh, i put out fgo video uh, once or twice a week you know uh, depending on the amount of content that i have and the events and stuff so i also uh, like, you know, put out fgo gameplay videos the event gameplays as well so if you're interested in them be sure to subscribe and i'll also be linking down my playlist my fgo playlist which contains all my FGO videos on my channel in the description box below. You can click on it and you'll find all my other FGO related content. And the original video that, that I'm reacting to this, in this uh, reaction video will also be linked down in the description box. So yeah, so that's it guys. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next FGO video. So until then, goodbye and have a nice day.